Hello everybody. The supercharger on my Sea-Doo jet boat is due for service. This is a 2008 and the superchargers are recommended that they be rebuilt at uh, two years or 100 hours. I'm at about 120 hours and 12 years. So I thought I'd save myself a little bit of money by pulling the supercharger off myself. And then I'll either take it to my dealer to have them rebuild it, or I'll send it off to one of the reputable internet builders. But there's a little trick to getting it off that I thought I'd share with you. First of all, there are three screws that hold the supercharger onto the engine. In my case, there's one here, one here. And the heads of both of those screws are facing the back of the boat. And then there's a third screw on this side, and the head of that screw is actually facing the front of the boat. So you're trying to remove three screws in this particular case to get that supercharger off. A lot of the internet sites tell you to remove clamps and hoses and all kinds of stuff. What I found is the biggest trick to getting this off easily deals with the muffler clamp. So thanks for watching. That's my hint, not only for you, but for myself in the future. If you found this video helpful or informative, how about a like, thumbs up, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.